Hello everyone, welcome to Public Linked. So in this video we will learn how to integrate Instagram and Beamer. So our use case is pretty simple. When a new media is uploaded in Instagram, it will automatically create a post in Beamer. Now Instagram is an awesome social networking site and Beamer is a notification software. So what we are going to do is we are going to send the data from Instagram to Beamer. But there is one minor problem. There is no integration between Instagram and Beamer. So in cases like this, we have to bring a third app to properly connect them both. So in this video, we will be using Public Connect to integrate Instagram and Beamer. And the best part of using Public Connect is there is no need for coding skills or programming knowledge. It can be done easily. Let me show you on my screen. Okay, so to begin the process, first type pabli.com in your browser. Pabli.com, press enter. Okay, so this is the website of Pabli.com. Here hover on products and at the bottom you will find the option called as connect. Click on connect and then click on sign in. Okay, so this is the dashboard of Pabli Connect. As you can see, I already have made an account in Pabli Connect. You can also create your own free account in just two minutes. Here I would like to mention one more thing that Pabli Connect offers a plan where this integration can be tried out absolutely free. So you just have to clone the template of its workflow which is available in the description box. Once you clone the template, you will get immediate access to this amazing workflow in your account. Ok, so scroll down and at the bottom you will find connect, just click on access now. Ok, so at the top right corner you will find a button, create workflow, click this. A dialog box appears in front of you. It is asking you to give a name to this workflow. I am going to give it as Instagram to Beamer. Instagram to Beamer. And then just click on create. Okay, so when you click on create, a window appears in front of you. This is called as the trigger window. So in the choose app, how about we make it as Instagram. Okay, so here you have two choices. Simple Instagram and Instagram for business. Both of them are same, especially concerning the triggers. Now, if you have uh, Instagram for business, you can select this account. But I am going with this one, Instagram. Okay, now coming to the trigger events, there is only one trigger event that is new media posted in my account. Select this. Okay, so new media posted in my account is a trigger event. So your obvious question is, what is a trigger event? Trigger is basically a if statement. It asks a question, if the condition is met, what should be done? For example, if a new media is posted, then what action should be taken by the system? At present, there is only one trigger event, that is new media posted in my account. Now in case, if you want more triggers of your choice, you can make a request to our team at admin at the rate pabli.com for the specific trigger that you want to build but at present i just want to send the data when a new media is posted in my account okay so just click on connect with instagram in the new credentials just again click on connect with instagram okay so public connect is demanding access just click on allow excellent so it is showing the authorization is successful just click on OK. OK, so when you click on OK, you will find the button Save and Send Test Request. Now, usually what happens is that after choosing the app and after choosing the trigger event, we basically copy the webhook URL into the trigger software. But in this case, all we have to do is just click on Save and Send Test Request. So when we click on Save and Send Test Request, it will fetch the data of the recently created Instagram post. So let me take you to Instagram. Okay, so this is my Instagram page and this is the recently created post. Okay, so the post name is Samsung Phone Review and this is uh, my profile Honest Review 102. Okay, so when I go to Pabli Connect and when I click on Save and Send Test Request, it will fetch the details of this particular post because this particular post was the recently created one. So let me do that. Okay. Okay, so the API response is showing the data. So as you can see, the username is honestreview102. That is because that's my profile name, honestreview102. Okay, and then we have uh, uh, the permalink. Okay, so let's explore this. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to copy this permalink and open this in a new tab. Okay. 
so as you can see we got the same post that was recently uploaded in instagram okay and then we have the caption as samsung phone review excellent so basically we have got all the details sufficient enough to create a post in beamer so scroll down and click on this plus button okay so when you click on this plus button another window opens up this is called as the action window so in the choose app how about we make it as beamer okay we have selected it okay so there is only one action event that is create a post now just like the triggers if you don't find or if you want more action events according to your choice you can make a request to our team at admin at the readpably.com for the specific action event that you want to build but at present i just want to create a post in beamer okay so click on connect with beamer in the new credentials we have to get an api key so to get the api key let's have a visit to beamer so this is my beamer account so first of all i'm going to go to this part at the left bottom you will find the option called as settings click on settings okay so here you will find the option called as api click this so as you can see these are the api keys i have created so i'm going to create a new api key for your consideration so click on this button create new api key okay so this is the key generated and i'm going to give a name to this alias so the name is insta because we are creating this for instagram okay and then we are just going to click on copy okay so the key has been copied and we are just going to paste it here okay so we have entered the api key just click on save okay so when you click on save a set of blanks has appeared in front of you the purpose of this blank is very simple we are going to create a post in Beamer from the data that we have received from Instagram via Public Connect. Okay, so coming to the title, the title can be something like uh, this is a new post. And uh, in the post, uh, we can just type in the name of the username. Basically, this is the profile of my Instagram page, Honest Review. This is a new post in Honest Review okay so we can we have done it now in the content we can just basically map in the caption so that is samsung phone review the category i'm keeping it as new the publish setting i am going to just simply publish it and in the link url we are just going to map in the permalink so where is our permalink okay yeah this one okay so link text i'm just going to ignore it link setting open links in a new tab publication date i'm just going to map in the time at which the instagram profile was uh, the post was created okay there is no need for expiration date the language is english feedback setting enable feedback reaction settings enable reaction enable sharing okay okay so basically we have uh, filled all sufficient detail to create a post in beamer just click on save and send test request okay so the api response is showing the data has been sent so let's have a look in beamer so so as you can see we are going to uh, our dashboard okay so this is our uh, uh, post this is a new post in honest review 102 and samsung phone review and uh, here is the link so let's explore this yes it's the same link that has been recently uploaded excellent so our integration is uh, working this means that we have successfully integrated instagram and beamer with help of public connect so how about we double check if our integration is working fine or not but before we do that let me go to public connect and let me explain you the whole process in a nutshell so what i'm going to do here is i'm going to minimize my action window and i'm going to minimize my trigger window okay so basically this is the whole process in a nutshell first you integrated instagram to public connect and then you have integrated public connect to beamer so now there is a perfect flow of data between instagram and beamer okay so let me go to instagram and let me upload one more post okay so a new post or a new media has been uploaded in instagram so let's have a look in beamer do we have a message concerning the same so i'm going to refresh uh, my beamer profile okay so let's have a look okay so as you can see the post is not available yet so this is because instagram actually takes an appreciable amount of time to send the data so basically we have to wait five or six minutes to get the result so i will update the result as soon as i get it okay so after five six minutes we have got the result so this is a new post in honest review 102 and this is the caption blackberry phone review and then we have the link so let's explore it 
okay yes uh, we have the post the correct post that is of blackberry excellent so our integration is working absolutely fine this means anytime a new post or a media is uh, uploaded in instagram it will be reflected as a post in beamer not just these two apps you can integrate up plenty of applications using pabli connect if you have any queries contact us at admin at the rate pabli.com our dedicated team members will help you to automate your workflows or better just visit our website www.pabli.com it's awesome. Thanks.